I believe I stamped the wrong ordinance. To which Walton City Council member Terry Courtney says. When he vetoes, it's a stamp. When he signs, he signs. So just so that we're all clear. I don't know how that can be confused. But I motion to pass. I second that. Walton City Council wants to create stricter policies for using and tracking the city credit card. This after a 2013 state audit found multiple discrepancies under the then administration. Mayor Brown vetoed the legislation, but says he didn't. It was reported at the last meeting that the mayor vetoed the ordinance, uh, but that he did not uh, send a, a message back to council explaining the reasons why. I talked to him today. He said he didn't intend to veto it thought he signed it. I think there's just a little confusion and there's been a lot of uh, a lot of activity going on at, at City Hall as far as it goes right now and uh, frankly none of it's been really productive. Some of that activity is the open investigation into the mayor's alleged credit card misuse. He says they won't find any wrongdoing and that it's politically motivated. Why does it take an attorney to catch, uh, to catch uh, something that was missed on credit card statements when that's the job of counsel. Uh, I'm just curious as to why they didn't catch it and why it's such a big deal now. Council members wouldn't say anything about talks of impeaching Brown, but he's prepared to react in the likelihood they do. I'm a fighting kind of guy, you know, I'm a little feisty, so I I want to say yes, but I think that'll be a decision for my wife and I, uh, my family, I, I don't know. Brown threw in the towel once, citing mounting pressure from the council. He rescinded it before it could take effect. Well, you all want to fight, you want to play games, and let's go. You can always find our stories here on YouTube, but go ahead and tap subscribe, that way you're always in the know.